Hello, hello, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I figured I'd be doing a little something different, and that is to try on all of the clothes that I recently purchased for preparation for our upcoming Disney trip, as well as just a seasonal refresh. So our trip is in early spring, early to middle spring. I don't, I think it's early spring, actually. It's like the end of March into early April. And so um, we're at the very beginning of the spring and summer season. So I didn't buy anything specifically for like Disney World, but I bought stuff for the entire season with being able to put some like Disney uh, like accessories along with that outfit. So, you know, that's, that's kind of the deal. A little bit about what I specifically bought. I didn't get anything like super dressy because I am an ADHD mom and so I get super overstimulated by my clothing. So if I'm wearing something that's like uncomfortable in any sort of way, it will instantly overstimulate me and make me just like really, it, it just pretty much puts me out of commission for the entire day until I'm able to change into something that's a little bit more comfortable. So comfort was the main priority on top of something that's kind of cute that I can kind of feel comfortable in, like the way I look and the way that I feel. So hopefully um, I didn't lose your <laughs> interest with that, but um, I did find most of this on Amazon. I will tell you the one or two things that I didn't get off of Amazon, um, but majority of it is Amazon. Okay. Let me get going with the first outfit here. Okay, so first things first, I ended up getting this little romper here and it is very comfortable. I actually got it a couple sizes, I think like one size bigger because I wanted it to fit more loose rather than tight fitted and I noted that on the reviews it did say that it does kind of fit a little bit more tight fitted. So um, I was thinking I could probably get like a cute like like sports bra or some sort of cute bra of some kind and like unbutton some of these and kind of make it a little cuter. But I like the short length and I like that they're kind of like baggy on my legs because it just fits more comfortably that way. I also like that it has this like drawstring area. You can tighten it. I don't need to, so I don't plan to do that. But um, I do really like the way that it fits. It's kind of baggier up top and then like I said, if I were to unbutton any of these buttons, I would do that. I don't have any need to do so. But I also thought that this color would be kind of cute with, these head with this headband. Although now that I'm looking at them in comparison, the headband doesn't seem to go very well with this uh, color. But I did get another one, another romper that is the exact same, exactly the same, it's just a different color. So I'm gonna try that one on next, but I do think that this is a really good fit. I'm really not usually one that likes to wear tank tops because I am still on the heavier side from having my kids and things, but my daughter's a year and a half, so I don't think that I'm going to be like dropping a bunch of weight really soon, although I would like to, you know, tighten up a little bit, I think. All that is another thing to say, but I don't mind this. I think that it's, it's comfortable, it's flowy, it's not like tight fitting and um, the material is nice and soft, so I rate this at least a seven. Okay, so this is this different color. It's like a dark, I don't even know if I'd call it, it's like an emerald, like a dark emerald green color, but I thought it would be kind of good to tie this color. It's still not right on the color mark, but it's close. Um, but I might end up trying to see if I can find some sort of cute, like, bra type situation, like bralette style situation that's not revealing because that's just so not me but something that could go underneath it to kind of make it look a little bit cuter because it buttoned is not really doing me very well i also do have different jewelry that i do plan on bringing and wearing so do with that what you will but even without the ears i do still like this fit and i do like the color so i am happy with these i think that they are cute and comfortable um i feel like on screen like on my camera, it doesn't look quite as cute as it does in person, but that's a whole other different thing. Hopefully you can kind of get the idea. Um, I will link everything below, as I said, but again, I rate this one a seven as well. Okay, so staying in line with the romper idea, I did go ahead and get this like free people style romper dupe off of Amazon. Um, I don't really, I'm not, like I said, I'm not really big on like tank tops, so that wasn't really my idea. 
So I did go ahead and find like a striped t-shirt. I had just got that from Walmart. Um, I think it was like six bucks or something crazy like that. So it was a really good deal. And um, I just think that this is a cuter outfit. This is just a lot more comfortable. This is more my style if I'm being honest with you. And um, it's not super lengthy to where it looks like boyish. Like there's still definitely some like knee exposure there. So I still think it kind of has a feminine take on it. And then also I will have jewelry, which I just realized I'm missing an earring because I just tried on some new earrings and I guess I forgot to put my hips back in. So yikes. But anyways, I do really like this one. Like I said, this is off of Amazon and then this is just from Walmart, but I will link what I can below for you. I think I rate this one. I don't know. What do we want to rate this one? I think I like this one. I think I'll rate this a nine. Um, I do plan on possibly wearing this one twice, depending, just depending on how everything goes. But I figured I could also get like a racerback tank top, um, one of those like ribbed white racerback tank tops to wear underneath this as well and make it like a two outfit type situation. Um, I haven't bought the tank top yet but I did see those at Walmart as well so I will probably be going by there eventually and getting one of those but just an idea so yeah I rate this one a nine okay so I'm a little bit more unsure about this outfit only because I bought this one on a whim but I don't know so it's a lot bigger in ways than I was expecting it to be so the top is very large like very oversized and large um, and then the shorts are still like pretty short. I was wanting them to be less short than they are. Like I don't feel like like my bum, like my bum's gonna be hanging out. But I definitely feel like I don't know. I, I just they're they're right there to where I'm almost too uncomfortable to wear them. So I don't know. I don't know if this one will be coming with us on vacation or not, or if I'll have to just return this. But I want to like it, if I'm being honest with you. I did go ahead and cuff the sleeves here because, but I don't think they're gonna stay. It's already unrolling on the underneath side here. But the sleeves are extremely long and the shirt itself is extremely long, like almost to where it's just like really unflattering. But the shorts, like I said, are still like almost too short. So. I don't know. I really, I'm not like super happy with this one. So I'm not sure if I'll be bringing it or if I'll just be returning it, but I want to like it. I, I like the idea of it. It is kind of lightweight. I don't know. It's right on the cusp of being lightweight or I think it's actually heavier. It, it feels lightweight, but it's, it's actually kind of a heavier material. I think, I don't know. I can't, I honestly can't even tell you guys, but it's like, um, like a, almost like a waffle knit material. And it's kind of soft, but it almost feels like like a swimming suit. I don't know if that's actually, it doesn't feel like a swimming suit, but it feels like something that you would wear with water, like mesh, but it's like heavy, like the, it's like a heavy material. It's really unusual. So I'm going to read this one like a four and a half or five. I'm not super happy with this one, if I'm being honest, and I think I might end up returning it. So that's that okay so lastly I ended up getting both of these things from Walmart the top is from Walmart and the shorts are from Target so the shorts are a little bit shorter than I was hoping they would be but I do like that they are brown these are actually by the Joy Lab brand from Target they are like it's a bike short on the underneath side and then they part on the side here if you can tell uh, there is a like pocket here for like your phone or whatever you would want it to be for. I do like that they are flowy, but they do feel a little bit shorter for me. So I'm not exactly sure how I feel about that. Um, and then the t-shirt I bought to be quite a bit larger than my actual size because I wanted it to fit more flowy rather than form fitting. So to ensure that I just got it a lot larger. I got it about three sizes larger than I needed it to but I do like the way it fits. I'm not sure if I would wear these two as an outfit like I originally had imagined, but I do feel like it does look good for like two different outfits. So like I said, I'm still warming up to the idea of these shorts. I do like that they're flowy and they kind of look like a skirt almost, but they're shorts. 
but they do feel a little bit short for my liking. I'm looking at a mirror here. They do look a little bit short for my liking, and um, I, I, don't, I just wouldn't wear these as an actual outfit, but I do like them to separate. So that's my take. I would rate the shirt as like, I don't know, like an eight, and then the shorts I will rate as a seven, only because they do fit a little bit shorter than I would prefer them to fit but I guess I could have sized up and they might have felt a little bit longer, but I didn't want to size up everywhere because then it makes it unproportionate, if you know what I'm saying, so. That is that. I'm gonna get back changed to my original clothing and then I will wrap up this video here. Okay, so I'm back. Um, I was rating each outfit from one to 10 and 10 being like the best of the best. The only thing that I think I have purchased, actually I take that back. The three rompers are my all-time favorite. I really like the material of the blue and green one. I think that those are really lightweight and comfortable. I don't feel like super self-conscious of my midsection, which is usually where I kind of feel a little bit more self-conscious um, because I've had kids and you know all the things. This is just a very honest review, you guys. <laughs> so um, I do really like those. I would say those are probably closer to a 10 than when I originally rated them. And then I also really like the black romper with the striped shirt. I wish that black looked better on me. My color palette is more of an autumn, so more like softer colors like browns and things like that look better on me. But I still like the way that those fit. And I'm sure I could look for a different color in that exact romper because they come in a million different colors. And I could probably find one that's more in my color palette if I really wanted to. But all in all, I'm pretty happy with most of the things I purchased. I do think that I'm going to end up returning that brown that brown little two-piece outfit only because the more that I tried on, I've only tried that on one other time. And when I tried it on then, I still wasn't even super like thrilled with it. So I do think I'll probably end up returning that and hopefully buying something different before we go, although it's very much crunch time at this point. But that was my honest review. Like I said, I was very much geared towards things that I would be comfortable in, walking around, chasing after my kids and things like that. Um, I am ADHD as I had mentioned, so having anything that makes me feel like self-conscious or restricted in any kind of way um, really just throws me out of whack with like taking care of everything else that needs to be taken care of. Um, ADHD is a wild, <laughs> it's a wild thing, but that is definitely part of my daily life. I live in a t-shirt and leggings like 95% of my, my life <laughs> at this point since becoming a mom. So um, that is my review. That are all, That is all the outfits that I specifically bought for vacation and our seasonal refresh. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope maybe this was helpful for you to help you, maybe we have a similar body type and so that might help you look for clothes that is gonna be comfortable for you for the season or if you have an upcoming vacation. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you wanna follow along for the rest of the series I have coming up for leading up to our Disney World trip. I mentioned in my previous video that I will link above for you. I have a ton of more videos, a ton of videos coming still. Um, I'm putting out about two every single week on a Thursday and a Sunday. So I really hope that you stick around for that. I would love to have you here and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.